Hello everyone. Sorry if this is a bit of a funky angle or if my pregnant belly <laughs> sneaks into the shot at any time. Um, but today I wanted to film a flip through of volume one of my childhood albums. Um, so this is a We Are Memory Keepers album in lilac. I think the colour's called lilac. Um, and this houses photos that I have sort of um, inherited from my parents over the years. So these are not all of my childhood photos. They're just the ones that I have. My parents have a bunch of albums from when me and my brothers were kids. Um, but I wanted somewhere for all of my photos to go that I had. And um, yeah, so this is my life from birth up until age 13 in this album. There is a volume two, um, which is age 14 to 17 but I did most of those layouts a long time ago um, and just don't really want to share them because I'm not happy with them. <laughs> um, but this one I originally did um, years and years ago and then um, spent a couple of years re-scrapping the whole thing. Um, and I'm finally finished and finally comfortable sharing it with you. So yeah, this is just a little cover page. I think I scrap lifted the design at the time from somebody in a group that I was in. I don't remember their name, I'm sorry. Um, I know that this layout was done way back in like 2014, 2015 maybe. Um, and I just kept it in here as the uh, front cover. And then we go straight into when I was born basically. <laughs> um, these layouts um, were made with embellishments and papers from the crepe paper, I think it was called like Sweet Girl collection. There was a girl collection and a boy collection and I actually bought the girl and the boy collection at the time to put away for when I eventually had kids. <laughs> um, so I do have a bunch of <laughs> these collections um, waiting for our baby to be born as well. But I thought they'd be perfect for putting together my like baby photos as well. Um, so yeah, this one is like entirely that crepe paper collection. We've got a little um, 4 by 12 insert here with pictures from when I was a baby and more on the back of my christening day. It's my dad and one of my sisters, my auntie and me. And then this was also my christening day at some of my cousins and my mum and my auntie in there and that's a 6 by 12 layout. For a while I was obsessed with 6 by 12 layouts. Um, and then there's another 6 by 12 on the back of me and my mum. I can't believe I'm going to have my own little baby soon. So crazy. Got more 4 by 4 photos here, a little filler card there. And then me and my sister with some journaling and me and my older brother. And that's another photo of me and my older brother. One thing I love about this album is that um, there's inserts in here of like all different sizes and layouts of all different sizes. Um, I don't really make layouts anymore. So it's really nice to have them in this album. I love that one. And I love this one as well of me and my mum's mum, my nanny. And again, that was mainly used with that crate, uh, mainly put together with that crepe paper collection. This uh, was made with a kit back at, uh, back in the day. I was subscribed to a kit called Like Forever and they were around for a couple of years and then unfortunately had to close and they were honestly like the best scrapbook kits in the UK at the time. Um, and I got this collection, which I think was from my mind's eye maybe. Um, and I put together this layout and I scrap, uh, scrap lifted a girl who was also in the group. Again, I can't remember her name because this was years ago, but the idea was like, we are an and. So you did, you scrapbooked something that went together like something and something. So I did father and daughter. And then I have a beautiful layout here of me and my mum um, with a large format photo. And that was made using crepe paper. Um, I think it was Maggie Holmes Bloom collection. This is all just three by four photos, which I absolutely love, or three by four pockets, sorry. I just love how some of these pages turned out and they're just all random baby photos of me. And I will show you this. Um, 
this is me asleep in the pram and that little hat i actually have that for my baby to wear <laughs> some photos on the back there my first christmas so cute here's another six by twelve layout and again it's made with that crepe paper collection and then one there of my first holiday that was made with uh, Felicity Jane bits and crepe paper bits as well because I was also subscribed to Felicity Jane back then um, and then this was also a scrap lift I definitely scrap lifted this from somebody but again I don't remember who um, but it was just photos from our first holiday and again I think that was mostly put together with crepe paper And there's another crepe paper layout on the back. In case you can't tell, crepe paper is definitely my favourite of the manufacturers. Um, but again, I think these are also photos from that same holiday. Um, but they're all of like me and my dad in the swimming pool. <laughs> I love these. <laughs> another 6x12 layout of me and my auntie using that My Mind's Eye collection. I think it was My Mind's Eye. Um, I remember this particular collection was everywhere. And um, I ended up getting like three different lots of it from different kits. And I've still got some of it in my stash now. Oh, here it is. Look, how funny is that? I've still got um, a sheet of it here. My mind's eye on trend too. It was everywhere. <laughs> that is so funny. I cleared out some old craft stuff the other day and that was in there. So that's why that's on my desk. That's so funny. And then um, this one obviously jumps forward a little bit. This is me as a toddler and there's still some baby photos here, but I was a toddler here when my um, younger brother was born. So I thought it fit there okay. And that was made with random um, crepe paper and Felicity Jane bits. Another one of these three by four pocket inserts, which I really love. I want to get some more of these. Like I said, my little brother was born here and lots of pictures on the back. So the idea for me was that I wanted to have lots of layouts in here, but I also wanted to squeeze in as many photos as possible. So pockets like this are great because I can fit loads of photos into one insert. Sorry if you can hear weird noises in the background as well, by the way, one of my dogs, <laughs> the youngest one, the puppy, is playing with a ball um, in the background. It's the only way I can um, distract her while I'm trying to film. So um, sorry if you can hear her throwing her ball off the couch or chewing it. But yeah, so this is me getting a little bit older. It's my brother, Ryan. Uh, Ryan has actually just had a baby, um, a little girl, and she looks just like him. It's so funny. It's going to be um, funny to see her grow and um, see if she still looks like him as she gets bigger. You can also see some Project Life cards in here. I can't remember what this particular kit was called, but um, this whole Project Life kit sort of formed the basis of the colour scheme for this album for me. So you'll see that like, even though it's different collections, it is mainly like those pastel colours. That's what I was going for um, in this album and particularly these early years. And a lot of those Project Life cards had sewing on and I just thought they were so beautiful. Here's another layout, again with crepe paper, me and my nanny's garden. And then a layout of my parents' wedding. And I was actually a bridesmaid at my parents' wedding. Uh, they got married when I was three. But yeah, so that's the layout of my parents' wedding. And that's actually a really old layout full of really old um, collections and, and bits and bobs. I don't even know where the majority of that is from. I can tell that this teacup here is definitely like a crepe paper type thing. But yeah, the rest of it, no idea where it's from. This one here, still me as a toddler. This was a Bella Boulevard collection, I think, or maybe a Simple Stories collection. Can't remember, but I think I got it in a like forever kit and I really like how this turned out. And then this layout on the back, I'm pretty sure I got these supplies in a like forever kit as well. But again, not sure what collection they're from. I think it's a Dear Lizzie one, looking at these um, embellishments here. And this was like um, to show me growing. So I've got like four, five and six. Some more four by four photos here. Preschool, me and my brother. And then some more on the back. This is all Felicity Jane. 
this one is an older layout again with some older dear lizzie supplies i think um that i kept in the album because i liked the photos and i didn't want to take it all apart but yeah it's um, an older one that i didn't redo and then same as this one here i think this is all simple stories um just documenting a beach trip i've got a 12 by 12 photo here of me and my brother and it's one of my favorite photos of me and my brother this is that same collection that i was talking about before it's either simple stories or bella boulevard i'm not sure just a super simple one and then we've got a pocket page and again i've got cards from that project life kit um and just trying to cram in as many photos as possible and this was christmas 1999 and then this was a holiday to fuerteventura and it's actually the only time that we went abroad as um, a family in my childhood my parents are both really scared of flying so we holidayed in the uk we didn't fly anywhere um, and this was the only time we ever went anywhere abroad um but yeah love those photos it's a mix of all different manufacturers i've got more of those project life cards those alphas are felicity jane this little swimming costume is a crepe paper travel collection and then um this layout of a beach day is also crepe paper but i have no idea what collection it was this was when my mum was pregnant with my second little brother who was born shortly afterwards and we've got his entry here <laughs> um this needs a backing paper or something i might just pick a nice patterned paper and put it in there because i don't really have any like um photos that i want to blow up to 12 by 12 so i'll pop a piece of uh, pattern paper in there four by four photos here this is my seventh birthday starting junior school and my little brother was born liam was born so i've got pictures here of him as a little baby he was so cute as you can see there's a bit of a jump because like i said i don't have like all of the childhood photos these are just the ones that i have so he was born here and then here he was already about two um but yeah so cute again i've got some more project life cards in here from different collections and um just a mix of supplies these look crepe paperish to me and then this layout was mainly put together with another project life kit it was a dear lizzie one um just childhood pictures really your standard childhood pictures birthday parties this was somebody's wedding i think the boys were matched um, and we were getting ready to go to a wedding um ryan and i made our own t-shirts <laughs> um a sleepover at my friend's house my eighth birthday um and then this is where i got poorly so i have crohn's disease and there aren't many pictures of me from around that time but i was very poorly this was christmas 2002 when i was out of hospital but still very much ill um and then this was like as i recovered over the next year and we got our first dog who was called Bonnie, love her, and we've got guinea pigs as well. These are some drawings and certificates that I got while I was in hospital. And then this is, again, a continuation of that following summer. So there's our guinea pigs and the dog. Got more photos here, mainly of my little brother. And then this page is, again, some drawings that like my brother did for me. Um, a little certificate from when I was a brownie. Some hilarious photos of me and my two best friends at the time. We used to have um, a sleepover every year for one of their birthdays. This was the original layout that I had um, in the album when I originally made it and I just left it as it was um, and added a few more embellishments to uh, this page, which I think all of the embellishments were from Crate Paper. And the cards were from a Project Life kit. Heading into 2004, our dog had puppies. So there's a bunch of photos of them. My brother's birthday. My other brother's birthday. My little cousin Eloise. She was so cute. Um, just more summer memories mainly. It seemed that 
the majority of the pictures that we had were from summer or Christmas because uh, digital cameras only really became a thing when Liam was born. So they didn't take pictures all the time like we do now. These cards are a mix of Felicity Jane and um, Crate Paper, uh, Project Life cards, sorry. Just journaling more random events. We've got birthdays, more summer photos right next to Christmas. So again, most of the photos I have are still like those normal family events. And I think uh, this is a real mismatch of... Um, embellishments as well I don't think they're all from one place I love these tiny thickers um I bought them in Hobbycraft they are actually like legit American Crafts thickers but they're so good these cards were all from a Project Life kit as well um again more birthdays a few days out with family friends and things just a few random embellishments again I can tell these embellishments are all crepe paper um a little holiday that we went on um, and this was the end of primary school for me so I've just covered that up because it's got the school that I went to. Again these are all from Project Life these cards um, and this was the second holiday that we went on to somewhere that was not um, England. <laughs> we went to Ireland because my grandparents um, were Irish and we went with them to visit lots of family in Ireland and it was lovely. And I found a little four leaf clover and I pressed it and I still have it now, which I think is pretty cool. So that's in there. Another hilarious sleepover with my friends. My first nephew was born. And there's some more pictures of him there with my dad. Um, these are all from that Project Life kit as well. I loved the ones that had stitching on. Um, and it just finishes with my 13th birthday there <laughs> and some great photos of me and a friend um so yeah that is volume one of my childhood album and like I said um there is a volume two but I'm not going to share that one just because I'm not happy with most of the layouts um but yeah I love this album I'm so glad to have all of these childhood memories documented it's so special to be able to look back and see these things um like i said i will pop a bit of patterned paper in there i think um but yeah love it so glad to have another album finished and be able to share it with you and yeah if you have any questions let me know if not i will see you next time bye guys